Let's see what is the VBA code to copy and paste only filtered data. In this file, I have two sheets, sheet 1 and sheet 2. On sheet 1, I have data in three columns. I want to filter this data basis on values in column B. So, here in column B, if I select any specific value, let's say I select HDFC, then there are four lines for HDFC. Then I want to copy these lines and paste into sheet 2. So manually we can apply filter and do this task. But what is the VBA code that can work for copy and pasting only filter data that I have written on command button. So here we can see that I have one command button. Once I click this command button, what will happen? It will copy all the lines only for HDFC and paste onto the sheet 2. So let me go to sheet 2. We can see that all four lines are copied and pasted. So let me show what is the VBA code that I have used here. I will go to developer tab, click on design mode and then I will double click on this command button to view the code or even we can press Alt F11. So once I press this command button, we can see that this is the VB code that I have used. So let me explain this VB code. First, worksheets, then name of sheet, which is sheet one, dot rows. So I'm selecting only first row and then applying filter. To apply filter, we can write selection dot auto filter. It will apply filter in the selected row. So in here in this example, first row. And then this line I have used to provide criteria as HDFC. So worksheets sheet one dot says dot auto filter field equal to two. That means column B comma criteria one equal to HDFC. HDFC is a string value. So I have given in inverted commas and then here comes the specific line that is selecting only filtered data so worksheet sheet one dot says one comma one dot special shells excel cell type visible dot select so let me write here comment as to select only visible cells and then selection dot copy once visible cells are copied then sheet 2 dot select and first cell that is a1 is selected on sheet 2 and then worksheets sheet 2 dot paste so pasting is sheet property so after selecting a1 here I have used worksheets dot paste property and then once it is pasted sheet one dot activate and now once data is pasted onto sheet two I want to remove filter and for that again I am selecting first row then selection dot auto filter so if already filter is applied it will remove the filter and then selecting first cell and then application dot cut copy mode equal to false so this is the simple code that we can use to copy and paste only filtered data we can make changes in this code according to our requirement let's say if there is a requirement that i want to ask user or take input for value basis on what we can filter data so let me go to sheet 
so here instead of giving a static value or a specific value hdfc whatever value user provides that should be used as filter value and then only that data should be copied so there are just two three lines of code just one small change we can add here in terms of VBA code to give that flexibility so here in this VBA code what I'll do I will write dim a as a string then a equal to input box within brackets we can give any message like enter a value for filter and now instead of giving a specific value here I will pass a so what will happen whatever value user will provide will be used as filter and then that filtered data will be copied on sheet 2 so let's see how this code is working on sheet 2 let me delete this data now when I click this command button it is giving me input box message is enter a value for filter this time let me give I N F Y so we have this value in column B once I press OK so what will happen we are expecting that only lines where in column B we have value as Infosys or Enfi that data is copied to sheet 2 so why we need to do programming for this task because to perform on this task it takes a lot of time when we have large data set and in that situation transferring data takes lot of time so to avoid that time consumption we can automate this with simple VBA code so let me show the code again so there are multiple uses of this code we can utilize in our routine task let's say if we have data on one sheet and we want to filter data and then transfer that data to multiple sheets even that can be done with some more addition of VBA code and if for multiple values we want to transfer data on only one another sheet that can also be done with some additional code so I hope you enjoyed this tutorial if you have any question around this topic you can write into comments for any question or any additional code you can send me email I will respond on that you can subscribe to my channel to get notifications for upcoming tutorials thank you